All right, everybody, welcome back to episode number two of our time here in Georgia. We are walking down now uh, to go grab the trail camera. Chandler and I are gonna walk down here and just kind of see um, what, if anything, we caught on camera. Um, I'm, I kind of think that the gate, there's a deer, there's a deer, there's a deer, there's a deer. I'm not sure if you guys can make that out, but there is a deer right there. If I can sneak up on him a little bit, see what he might be. Can you see him? All right, Chandler, come on. Well, that was exciting. Um, not sure how much of that I'm gonna end up including in the final video, but as we were walking down here to check the camera, uh, we actually had a deer um, that was just right over here uh, to the right of the camera on uh, the neighbor's property. But uh, we're gonna go ahead and grab the card and uh, you guys are gonna have to wait and see exactly what's on it though. So Something was down here, we'll see. Might've been Ricky. We'll have to find out. All right, everybody. I know that I said that there was going to be a little bit of a wait. I was going to make you guys wait until the end of the video to see the trail camera footage. Uh, however, uh, there's nothing to review. Uh, so we're just going to go ahead and put get that out of the way now. There was nothing on there. The camera was there for six days. Uh, we caught a raccoon and a rabbit. That's it. Um, uh, now I did start to say this before we, that deer kind of spooked when we were back there earlier, but there is a fence around the entire property back there. Now it's not super tall, but it's tall enough that I think the deer have a hard time getting over it. Um, and because of that, that's why I feel like we saw deer back there, but never actually got any of them on camera because they just couldn't jump the fence to get there. Now, back in May when I was here, I did catch deer. And I really think that the reason I was able to do that is because there is a gate uh, between the two properties, between the neighbor over here and my in-laws property. And I think in May that might've been open. If that gate was open, it would have allowed the deer to get in there, which, which is why I was able to catch them on camera. That being said, it was still fun to do one way or the other, even though I didn't catch anything. Uh, do I plan on hunting down here? Maybe someday, but it's not in the near future that I had every any intention of doing so. Uh, that being said, stay tuned. So stick around. All right, as you can see, we made it back from Georgia without any problems. It's now the next day. Um, we spent the day we got back just recovering from the trip. That is a very long drive with two kids and two dogs. Uh, that being said, it is time to decorate our house for Christmas. I am in the spirit, as you can tell. And we got a time lapse that we're gonna set up for uh, setting up our Christmas tree and uh, showing some of the other decorations and stuff that we do around the house uh, for the holidays. So enjoy this. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and end this video. Thank you very much for watching. 
And please like this video if you enjoy content like this and want to see some more. Also, click that subscribe button and select the little bell so that you get notified of any future releases from this channel. Again, thank you very much for watching. Have an absolutely wonderful rest of your day. Happy holidays from Caldwell Country Outdoors.